Hey guys, it's Friday. Get ready for the weekend wipe. All of my 5X servers will be wiping after this video. Details are posted here on screen. Now onto the raids. So, I think we've finally found a base worthy of using a ton of C4 on. I've previously already taken out one of their external TCs, which gave me some really decent building privilege. Set an auto turret up to guard where I plan on going in, which is on the neck of this thing, on the stone. And then we'll drill down once we find a path. Hopefully we find a path. Somebody's taking heli over there. But check out this building privilege. We can actually build all the way over his high walls. Almost can jump right onto the side of his base. Building priv ends here though. You know what, with a box, can we make it? Okay. I might actually be able to jump onto the base. Oof, it was close. Stick to the plan here. We're gonna drill into the side of this neck. Please don't be armored. Ooh, it's all open in there. Any turrets? Ooh, turret, but it's turned up. Turrets are all turned off. These guys broke or something? Just looking for a door here. Here's an armored door, but Check out how big this middle base is. I think it's gonna be airlocked, yeah. See, there's a garage door there. Let's blow into the opposite side where we first came in and we're gonna start drilling. Whew. Auto turret and what looks to be another ring around the base. Okay, now it's armored. Maybe some rockets here. I mean, that thing's guarding our back. We should be safe. That turret didn't get destroyed, but it got turned off. Damage these almost halfway. I guess we'll finish them out with rockets. What is that twig? Okay, what is this design, dude? What the frick? We can get in here for free. Can we take these controls out? Maybe leading to some turrets and stuff? Yeah, turrets turned off now. Here's some flame traps. Don't really have to worry about those. This looks like an airlock coming from the front, possibly. We'll follow this into the center since we're already near the core. Let's see, I think that's a sleeping bag. multiple doors or an armored wall and a door maybe rockets here not sure which pathway to take okay that one looks like it's leading outwards probably gonna skip that one This must be the center. These are probably all going around it. That'd be my guess. We'll see if we're straight into one of these armored walls. I assume this is the core.
Yeah, sleeper. Just a couple small boxes, though. HNIC clan. These guys are big. What is this? Is there loot above? Before we do take that long path above, I want to see where this door goes. I'll scan out. Oh, oh. Okay, now we hear vending machines here. Yep, there's definitely vending machines on this side. Just cooking up metal, getting closer to those vending machines. There we are. Could this be the main loot? Looks like it could be six tech trash. Tools. Okay, not much so far. Maybe just a gearing up spot of the base, but 120 explosives. And that's about it. So those door paths seem like they're all just going around in a circle to this room. I guess we'll start heading up now. Only got about 13 C4 left. Five rockets. Okay, this thing is really nicely airlocked up. It's still gonna be the cheapest path to go through the garages. Oh my gosh. Does it not have ammo? All right. Guessing it's gonna be the same design for these garage doors all the way up. Luckily we have a bunch of explosive ammo. Let's keep on following it. Probably cut a lot of this out and I'll come back once we've gone through most of these. All right, it became sheet metal. Took out that last path of garage doors. We're about two or three stories up now. Finally, we've got something here. Hatch and some more sheet doors. Another sleeper. Actually had an MGL on him. We could use that. We've only got a few explosives left to use on this base. Haven't found anything yet up on the top. What the heck? Bunch of controls? And a coffin? Alright, well... I guess that's a good spot to end it. We've used everything I came here with. M2's just about to break. I don't think I'm gonna be able to find anything in this base. Just really extremely well built. We'll take out their battery and controls just to annoy them. But our luck did run out on this clan base. I mean, it was kind of expected once I saw H and IC clan. These guys are extremely good builders. Let's piss them off by taking their turrets out. And we'll call it there. So I found a base made solely for the purpose of a large furnace, hoping to find some sulfur in that thing. If not, we can raid what seems to be the actual base behind it. And he's got a sheet metal door here with a key lock. It's probably a solo player. Just hoping he's been farming recently. I don't know if we're actually gonna be able to jump out of here because it's built on water. So I'm gonna go ahead and just take this door and we'll use that as a platform to jump out.
Oh my god, we're actually getting countered. That's TC though. Did the furnace have anything? Just wood? By the way, what was in here? Explosive ammo? Some components. And TC had 35,000 soul for war, guys. Let's go. We're gonna actually need to defend this from this counter reader. I was not expecting that much loot in this such a small base. Yo, that's actually the fishing freaking village shooting me. Oh my gosh. Wow. Would you look at that? Fishing village is on my butt. No worries of getting countered or killed. Who would have thought the range on those things were so far? Let's go, boys. I'm gonna go home and cook this sulfur up. Maybe we can find another base. We'll see what happens.